Hi guys, Tops here. Today I want to show you this Dell all-in-one PC. It's actually Dell XPS 1 A2010. How to open it and just go through a few things that you could do with this PC. It's a lovely PC when it came out. At the back is absolutely, the person who had this absolutely looked after it really well. So you've got four USB SP optical 1394 full size um, I forgot that one AV even a TV aerial here power Ethernet as we say in the UK you get your power button or something here the reset button and you've got your power button here HD microphone headphones another two USB 1394 small one and I think this was a Sony card reader or multimedia card reader it's absolutely beautiful it did it came with a remote like so because it's an entertainment PC and wireless keyboard and wireless mouse as well and you've got your slide in optical drive here as well I absolutely love this PC guys you see this cable that's the power cable it came with originally look at the feature it even has color coded lip here to make it all flush to fit in it's all about aesthetic now when this originally came out it was designed to compete with the iMac Apple iMac and I think it did and um, whoever had this PC they preferred this one because I don't want to damage the screen or anything so I've got it on a tea towel here and that's the back of the PC now to open it I remember the first time I had to when I was working on this I was looking everywhere to open it and I couldn't find it now at the bottom underneath if you look there's one screw here and one screw there and if you guys have seen my other all-in-one Lenovo opening it's very similar so I'm gonna go and undo those two screws and this glass base is perfectly lined so you can absolutely reach it like that all right and it doesn't get in the way and just unscrew and it's similar type to normal standard laptop screws so put that to one side and open up with this one here and then push down and pull away there we are nice and easy and it comes off there you go So this is the base and we're going to look up what we got. We've got a fan here. This is your small fan and your power supply unit is there. The RAM is here. We've already upgraded. I've worked on this one before and upgraded the RAM to, I, it's, it's up, at the moment it's got four gigabyte and I believe that's the highest it can go. If, if, it's, if I'm wrong, then let me know. Your CPU is here and you got another fan to keep all of this cool optical drive here and what else you've got another little power supply thing going on underneath here as well um hard drive now hard drive is under this guy and what i've noticed is if you take this cable off now this gives you a potential guys what could you do you could put a caddy in here to hold and you could actually put SSD drive in there and then that would be brilliant at the moment there's a dual core in this PC you could put a quad core in there and I forget it's a yeah there is an upgrade you could do on the CPU all right I wish you could take the RAM up to 8 gigabyte that would have been absolutely fantastic but it doesn't look like you can but if I'm wrong let me know guys so if you wanted to upgrade the hard drive guys, one, two, and three, four to undo, so it comes away from this caddy. You could put our SSD drive in there, but you'll need another caddy to go from a 2.5 inch down to there, so it holds onto this caddy, and it can be done really easily guys. So if anyone's thinking about putting an SSD drive in the XPS and making it faster, you can, it can be done. So hopefully guys, it shows you how to open this and the main features inside. Thank you so much for watching and if you liked it give us a thumbs up share 
and go ahead and you know it's getting 10 years old there's lots you can do with this pc guys